More details were unveiled today on South Korea's test flight of a domestically developed solid fuel space rocket last week. Our foreign affairs correspondent Choi Min Jung reports. South Korea assesses that its second test flight of a solid fuel space launch vehicle appears to be more successful than the first one. The Defense Ministry on Monday released a video of the homegrown rocket being launched and entering space. It said the state-run Agency for Defense Development tested the second, third and fourth stages of the launch, including the separation of a dummy satellite. It was able to verify the engine combustion for these stages as well. Last Friday, the Defense Ministry confirmed the success of the vehicle's second launch, which came nine months after the first test. The rocket is designed to put a small satellite into a low orbit for surveillance operations. It's aiming to launch an actual satellite in 2025. Compared with liquid fuel space vehicles, solid fuel rockets have simpler structure and are more cost effective to launch. The success of the test launch marks an important milestone in building the military's independence in the field, as well as the country's goal of becoming the seventh largest player in the global space industry. The ministry also said it's looking to transfer essential technologies to the private sector to boost the industry and create economic effects. Some citizens across the country witnessed Friday's launch and reported an unidentified flying object in the sky. The ministry explained that the test was conducted at night due to safety and weather conditions and to minimize disruptions for fishermen. Chemin Dong, Arirang News.